Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to show you how to create custom 404 pages using Astra. So first, let's talk about the importance of having a custom 404 page. So if we were to go to a made-up website name, let's say keyboardsmash.com slash, oh, all right. And you can say, you can see here that it says on our browser that this site can't be reached. Um, and that's it. And we can't do much but reload it. But what if the URL is valid? Let's say Instagram.com slash that. And it'll tell us, it'll give us an explanation that, well, for one, we know that Instagram.com works, so we're in the right place. However, uh, the page isn't available because it may be broken or the page may have been removed and it redirects us to the home page so at least it takes us there and you can do this with any website slash and the same thing we know that facebook.com works but the content that we're looking for isn't there or our url is wrong so we can either go back to the news feed go to the home page or visit the help center and if we did that with our website uh, because we have a starter template on here we can see that the page doesn't exist and the link is broken and at least for this template it's asking us to search for something or we can go back to our home page here by clicking on the icons so let's figure out how to customize it to make it look cool and give an explanation and redirect our users where we want them to go if a link is broken. So today we're going to be using the, oops, okay, we need to go to our dashboard here. And we're going to be using Astra's Site Builder. Okay, so we're here on the left sidebar. Scroll down here and click on Site Builder. And we're going to be using a custom layout for a 404 page. So here we have our site builder. Uh, down here we have 404 page. Let's click on that. And there's no layouts. So let's create a brand new one. Okay, once we're here, we can add anything we want. So let's say 404 page does not exist. Okay, and we can put on here, sorry, uh, the page Okay, and then we can fix this. Oh, and we can highlight it up bold. And we can add a and add a button here. Okay. And we can change the text to uh and then let's change the color of the text that we make it black, I guess, and the background is maybe red or something. There we go. Yeah, I had a hard time seeing it with the default colors that we selected. And outline. Oh. Okay. And we can make it, what, 100? No. Nah. 50, and let's put it on the center. Ah. Justify center line middle and then this one we can also center the text as well as this one now we'll remove this um, let's, let's call this 404 page all right and let's hide that and then add a header here head heading excuse me here header one make it big and in the center and we can push this up here and in fact to make it a bit more wacky we can even add an image ok 
Okay, and we can insert one from a URL. So let's go ahead and search sadface.png and copy the link address. I should read that. Oh, okay, here, all right. Copy image address, all right. And it should, okay, and then we can uh, align it on the center and adjust that here. And we can even make it smaller. There we go. I think that's a pretty appropriate 404 page. For this one, I forgot to add the the link for it. Oops. No, it's our home page over here. Okay. And we can preview it here. Preview in a new tab. All right, and we can return home and it takes us home. Okay, so let's go ahead and click on Astro over here and you can see the layout is for a 404 page and we can disable the primary header and disable the footer bar. And yeah, we can, we can enable it for all and we can enable or disable it on our other devices but this is a 404 page so we want it to be consistent at all and that's good so let's hit publish and our 404 page shall be live so we're here on our site we don't really need to refresh it so let's go ahead and input a random url and here is the new 404 page that we've just made. 404 page doesn't... 404. Oh, I should probably put a comma there. <laughs> 404. Page does not exist. And there's our sad face. Sorry, the page you're trying to access does not exist or the link you're using is broken. So it doesn't give us any options. Return home. And it takes us back to our home page. So if you found this video helpful, Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to our channel as it really helps us out with the YouTube algorithm. Show this kind of video to other nerds like us. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.